here today in Chicago on Lake Michigan at the Columbia Yacht Club and Sailing School. Katie Tinder, their sailing program manager, will be joining us to tell us more about the U.S. Sailing Reach curriculum and Module 6 on marine debris. Module 6 can be an excellent tool to enhance your community partnerships and sustainability at your organization. Katie, tell us about the history of STEM and sailing at Columbia Sailing School. Yeah. We've become more involved with the U.S. Sailing REACH curriculum and we implement it on a daily basis in our practices with our students. So we're trying to create um, an environment where the students are taking ownership of their local community and their waterways. Module 6 has been great for our program because it teaches our students about their local ecosystem of Chicago and the urban environment which has a big effect on our waterway of Lake Michigan. So what our students are learning is how their actions can have a positive impact on the environment that they're sailing in every day. So weather is a factor that we're seeing. So what, it, what are some of the things on here that would be affected by wind? We have two activities, one on shore where our students are picking up marine debris before it hits the water. The second one is our treasure hunt where the students are sailing and towing and jumping out of their boats to clean marine debris out of Lake Michigan. Today we're cleaning up around the harbor just all the garbage that accumulates from litterers or ends up in the lake and we're picking it all up. Um, the lesson I'm going to take away from this activity is just bringing more people my age, um, especially in high school because I feel not many people in high school help out with cleaning as much or they don't know how to. Picking up trash, avoiding one-time use plastics. Lives for the Great Lakes is a nonprofit organization uh, headquartered in Chicago with staff around the Great Lakes, and we're here because the Great Lakes are an incredible, globally unique clean water resource that we have right here in our backyard. And our job at the Alliance every day is to make sure that that resource stays clean and that people have the opportunity to use it and benefit from it all across the Great Lakes region. Here in Chicago, we've been working with the Columbia Yacht Club for more than a decade, and they've been great partners in helping us think through how the sailing community can get more involved in actively protecting these tremendous clean water resources. Young people can actually take the initiative and lead on their own with the right support, with the right tools, and we're glad to be able to be part of giving that to, to them. In the uh, new program, instead of using uh, bring in lunch every day, the kids use uh, ceramic plates and silverware. Uh, so that puts down on trash that they uh, have consistently uh, made. So now we've gone down from uh, you know a number of garbage bins a day to just one single garbage bin. Uh, we have our students bring their own water bottles, and the coaches actually bring out the uh, five-gallon jugs with a little water pump, so the kids can actually re uh, throw the water bottles on the water. Sailing is not just a sport, but a way to bring people together to accomplish a greater goal, from leadership development to STEM education, while having a positive impact on your environment. It is driving change at a local level, teaching young sailors, and creating a ripple effect in their communities.